fight alongside ultra marines. Eat that ration while you can. Fork brothers, I will make sure the captain hears of your deeds. I need no commendation. <laughs> Is that right? Enough! <laughs> Lieutenant, upon completion of this mission, I request transfer to another squad. I will pass your request to the captain. Psychic shadow that tears at the minds of psychers. Denying worlds in their path the chance to call for aid. Let us hope we are not too late. message from Marnius Kalgar. I cannot help you. It's urgent. In addition to the shadow cast in the warp by the Tyranids, demonic forces are now poised to attack anyone who opens their minds to the warp. You would flee from your duty. I would have you know. <laughs> Let us begin. My lady, I must protest. The danger is too great. Silence! There are no guarantees.
Chaos forces have been detected entering the system. They are going after Aurora. We are leaving for Demerium immediately. How did you know? I was a boy on Kalf when the word bearers attacked. I came to know the mark of chaos. We're returning to the battle barge. I understand your actions, but your suspicions end here. Are we clear? Yes, sir. In the last few hours, traitor forces have arrived in their hundreds and commandeered the facility. Commandeered? Where is Luz? Inside. They have the facility, Luz, and the power source. Holy terror. Perhaps you were right, Titus. What's our theoretical? We've diverted all available forces to the Merium, but we're well below full strength. We've prepared an assault, but it has little chance of success, unless we take care of this. They're using it to draw in reinforcements. For every one of them we kill, 
Two more show up in their place. It's heavily guarded. I'll need a combat squad. Five men. I can spare three men. Next. The enemy seem to be drawing their power from this structure. What is it? We don't know. Every attempt to bring it down has failed. Your squad has developed a reputation for unconventional approaches. Any ideas? I've read of Demirium. It's a burial world. 4,000 years ago, there was a clash between the Ultramarines and the Heretics. The Sword of Atreus, a battle barge wrecked in the fighting, was laid to rest here. What of it? Records state that while its body was ruined, its engines burned bright, even as it was interred. It may not fly, but it might ram. A long shot, to say the least. Worth a try. Very well, then. Navigation systems are probably dead. We can't afford to miss. He's right. Someone will need to get close to the target and place a beacon. Our offensive launches in 90 minutes. The Emperor guide you, brothers. And you, sir. As you wish, Chaplain. Ensure brothers Chiron and Gadriel are in attendance. Using an ancient battle barge as a battering ram. An unorthodox approach. You disapprove. On the contrary. It is inspired thinking. I reluctantly second that. Why reluctantly? Because it will go to your head. Titus, I am troubled by a report I have received from the Astro Telepathica. An accusation of heresy. Her voice was puppeted by her. The lieutenant will answer. The psycho was possessed. Your sergeant believed otherwise. I was mistaken. You attempted to incapacitate your lieutenant. Thank the Emperor, I failed. And now, the only individual capable of reaching Lord Kelgar is dead. By your hands. I will be watching all of you. Should I suspect even a flicker of corruption, I will not hesitate as you did. You are dismissed. Brother, what was spoken by the chaplain? Brothers, we have arrived at the burial. Time to go. of their forces in the Numerellian Basin. Talasa has the warp beacon. Viridian is hoping for a miracle. The rest of us will move to clear the reliquaries around the basin and establish a beachhead. We are facing overwhelming enemy numbers on Demerium, but the heretic filth down there have stirred the wrath of the Second Company. We will inflict upon the traitors such agony the likes of which they have not seen since the burning of Prospero. They will suffer, they will break, and they will fall. Sons of Gilliman, for the glory of Ultramar! For the glory of Ultramar! Titus, this is something that is 
side upon you. Galio, theoretically, Contacticus armor withstand a suborbital drop. Gravis is too cumbersome for our needs. Negative. Extreme risk. Dense debris fields litter the entry flight path. But if we avoid the debris, could we survive the descent? Calculating. Survival probability equal to 62.4136. Unacceptably low. Thank you, Galio. An orbital drop without Gravis armor. It is a sound strategy. With a 38% failure rate, we are facing much less favorable odds today. Brothers, our captain's words need no further embellishment. I will speak only of practical concerns. The heretics will employ absolute deception. You will be assaulted by lies and illusion. The only true ground you will find down there will be each other. Trust only your brothers and your instincts. Now go forth and lay waste to our enemies. For the Emperor! For the Emperor! Focus.
Emperor bless you, Grim. Ground and moving. Report status. We're approaching the battle march now. You are ahead of us. Make contact once the Atreus is ready to launch. We shall be done. Are we going to let them beat us, the objective, brother? Not today. They will not get past this.
sorcerer! I shall end his accursed rituals. to the cathedral. Proceed with caution. Thalassa, we are almost there. What is your status? The sleeping giant will soon awaken, brother. Hold for our signal. Locked in. Lock target now. 
Bridging signal data through telemetry systems. Numerous errors detected due to signal interference. Calculating trajectory. Champion 
the device might work. That it could weaken them. Perhaps they seek only the power source. Then why would they kill Nozick? I do not know, nor do I wish to speculate. We are here to end this folly, and so we shall. Better. Site of a Mechanicus macro weapon. An excavation site. Indeed. Our path leads down. Ready to deploy special tactics. Chiron to resilient. Enter a Mechanicus dig site. Requesting relevant cartography. Restricted by order of the Adeptus Mechanicus. This is Lieutenant Titus. Request authorized. Denied. Aurora seal required. Identify yourself. This is infuriating. All heretics. We are on the right path.
stalking. Your worthless life is in. said the traitor Nemeroth. Do you believe it? He certainly did. You said it was destroyed. Apparently not well enough. That damnable Archmagos. If it truly is tainted with corruption, then we must destroy it permanently. Agreed. That airlock leads into the mines. Gather inside. Entering quarantine zone. Decontamination required. Initiate biological purgation within the chamber. Microbial index 1.2%. Initiating sterilization. Barely a sign of life on this world. It is a burial world, brother. Reserved for the dead. Microbial index reduced to 0.01%. It is safe to proceed. Safe. Interesting choice of words. Pity this chamber cannot remove corruption. That duty is ours. Ancient ruins. A cover for their research, perhaps. The subject of it, more likely. The figures in these carvings are unusual. Ancient marks of the ruinous powers. Etched by fools. Long before the Great Crusade illuminated this world. These were not made by devotees of the warp. How do you know? You may soon see for yourself. enemy have penetrated deep into these caverns. Perhaps we will go to your waterfalls. What secrets this old stone holds? I only ask that it holds our weight.
Secured. 